Hello friends. This is a 100% playthrough of Quake on Nightmare Difficulty. This is E3M4, Satan's Dark Delight. Hey everybody, Satan's Dark Delight. Let's go a pooeeeth, pa, pee, pa, pop, 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 a pop. Okay, that's that done, and boing. Bouncing ogres, oh my. Don't go too far back, all the ogres up the top will grenade. Hey, yeah, just like that. <laughs> that goes up there, but it's barred off. Let's go down here. And swim with the fishes. Well, hopefully not. Mm, yes, yes. Make it through. Grab the rocket. It's very handy. Let's wake up fat ogre boy in the lift. Out you get. Yep, he's coming. He's coming now. Okay, cool. Yep, okay. <laughs> I'm not very fast in water. Ah, uh, yeah, grenade bounce, grenade bounce, grenade bounce. I gotta get past Fatty here. He's not gonna let me past, is he? No. Ow. Actually, yeah, let's just bop that. Grab some more health down here, I think. Might be a good idea. Okay. Another ogre in the wall. Ah. Uh, now, is this just gonna be a stalemate situation? Can I squeeze past and get the rocket launcher? Yeah, two ogres. Not good. Uh-huh. Whee! Suck it down, fools. Nice. Nab nab. Who else have we got? We got a bunch of fishes. I'll have to take care of them later. I do believe. Oi! A zombie it fleshed me. Nice. Well, I want this armor. Why did I jump down? <laughs> Why did I do that? Never mind. I'll slowly swim back. Oh. Maybe I wanted to take care of you subconsciously? Maybe. Let's grab some more health. Yeah, I'll take care of these fishies later. Do, 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 daddly, do, do, do. Back we go. Go away! Nya, nya. Got him. Oh! <laughs> Have to wait for the lift. Okay. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Um, yeah, those guys are all gone, but I'll... That, oh, I thought a fish bit me from below. <laughs> that would be very rude. Nah, it was just some... Just some flesh. Okay. Go away! Was that... Hmm, never mind. Hmm, just getting myself distracted. Okay, button. Okay, let's get ourselves a secret, huh? What do you say? Bloop. Shoot that. <laughs> Health, rockets, nails. Very cool. Got 21 rockets now. <sighs> Zoom. Okay, going through here. Yeah, I'll, I'll get you later, fishes. This bit's nasty. Oh, right in the face. That's fine. Rude. Oh yeah! This bit! I remember this from my very first playthrough of Quake. I thought it was really friggin' neat. Thank you. Uh oh. Grenade. <laughs> That's fine. Um, I think I'm gonna get rid of you. Because you're annoying. And also... A couple of ogres. Uh, is there another one there? I can't quite see. I'm pretty sure there is. Let's see if I can... Tease him out! Hmm, oh well, that's fine. We've got an ogre down here. Okay. Poop. Oh, <laughs> what am I doing? That was a shoot switch. But, I would like to. Yeah, try and draw some guys out. Damn it. Come back. We shall just patiently wait for the fiend to return. Unless he's dead. I can't tell, but I can't hear him growling. Oh well, I'll take the teleporter back and we'll find out. Here's you. Damn it, that was too low. That was too high. Well, the fiend's dead. <laughs> I'm gonna swap to the uh, perforator just to be a little bit more safe so I don't blow my face off. Face off. 
Okay, I've not got no problems with the secrets in this one. I do remember where they are, very much so. I'll just go this way and grab some more stuff. Do -do -do. It does mean backtracking. Boring. Sorry, but that's just the way it is. Do -do 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 -do. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, one thing I do remember from my very first playthrough was this bit did drag a little bit, but it's it's fun. It's got a really cool sort of platformy type of groove to it. It's nice. Come on, squish. <laughs> nice. Now I wanna jive with this boy here. Nice. Get this secret, which has got some. Oh no! It's not awfully um, helpful. That one there. Just shoot these. Because, yeah, you get a quad damage in this, but you really have to sort of backtrack. And by the time you do that, stuff's going to be wasted. I'm sure there's some excellent strategies out there on how to appropriately use them. But, um, I, I, God, all oh, right. <laughs> You're supposed to jump on that platform. Yeah, never mind. But still, I never use them in my playthroughs because um, t I just didn't really figure secrets out very much in Quake so I don't really feel like I do need them plus it adds to the challenge to not use quad damage and invulnerability since we're about to get another invulnerability and to have quad and invulnerability for that room that we're going to be going to in just a sec it, it really pulls the teeth out of it and it's not as fun so I like to do it sans power-ups that is my excuse for missing that platform <laughs> no no I just, yeah, just seems to not quite be the appropriate challenge because the overly, and I do mean overly generous, giving of power-ups really, um, yeah, trivializes this next fight in particular. Do, 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 waiting for the lift. Well, the platform, waiting for the platform. There was two ogres. Okay, I must have really bitched them up. Nice. Yeah, so up here we're going to get a bunch of ogres, uh, fiends, all in a very close space, right in our face, and uh, yeah, let's go and enjoy that. Actually, no, there's a little bit of that. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. Let's top up and go back up. No, you don't. You beast! Now I guess we'll, um... Oh yeah, there's you. Sorry buddy, I forgot about you. I suppose I will use this secret for this bit here. So yeah, yellow light signifies nice, tasty secret. It's really good of American McGee to signify the secrets in such a way. Zap! The Shambler is cooked. Now I'm going to... I guess I'll take the secret exit, which is just done by falling in that wind tunnel there. But I've still got a bit of clearing up to do, and I've got to kill those fish first. Rude. You're getting cooked too, my little friend. Why am I using this? <laughs> right, fish cleanup time. Don't need health. Wait. Um, oh, yeah. Let's just take him out with this. That should be everyone. That is everybody. I don't think I can go back that way. Ah, oh, yeah. Never mind. But I didn't want to go that way. Any who's. Because I want to take the secret exit for funsies. Because it's really fun getting down there and stuff. So we'll just retrace our steps. It's got a really... I'm going the wrong way. It's got a really nice flow, this map. I really like it. It's really cute. Big, big fan of American McGee's levels. Splonk. That's right, it's easy to retrace your steps. Boing. Bonk. And up we go. Hardest part of this map is just trying to, if you're doing a shotgun start like me on Nightmare, is just trying to get your way through the first bit. Just trying to get to that rocket launcher, because people will block you and it's just, it's beastly. Beastly, I says. And here we go. Nice. 
That was Satan's Dark Delight in 9 minutes 37 and 17 weeny seconds. Four secrets, 43 baddies, very low kill count, but that's original Quake for ya. Really good architecture, really good platforming, really good fun fights, and yeah, that nail-biting start just until you get the rocket launcher. Really cool. That definitely sets it apart from some others in my book. Thanks for watching. And next time we shall slide into slot number nine. Nearly finished. And um, yeah, I've had a really good time with this so far. Hope people are enjoying. See ya. Eduardo and friends.